Moon is doing fantastic. It is a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday night. We're back to doing a couple night times. Pretty excited for it. Uh, we're going to be doing Wednesdays and Thursdays. It's from 7 to 10 uh, Central Standard or Central Daylight Time. Um, but we're going to be doing some Skyrim, uh, which I haven't played for a little bit. But we're going to do another playthrough. And um, we're going to do like a book collection run is my plan. Because I love the lore and I love collecting all the books. So we're going to collect the books and kind of like read them as we go. That's the plan. We're going to be like a spell sword. We're running a couple mods. Um, nothing too crazy, but a little bit to kind of give us some. Um, what should we call it? Some like player. A little bit of ease of comfort. Of what we're doing. Uh, so we have the glowing books, the new book cover things, so they look nice. Uh, Sky UI, of course, because it makes the game just look nicer while you're playing. Um, all of the basic engine mod fixes to uh, make the game run smoother. And then we have a player home called Itzy Tower, which is like a giant crab. So it's kind of cool looking. And then, of course, we... we we got a, a perks changer, which kind of updates the perks to make them a little bit better. So we're going to try a spell sword run with all the all the fancy new spells. That's the plan for this run through Skyrim. I'm going to go ahead and pull it up, and we're going to get started. Brand new run. We got a book counter there. We're going to keep track. I have, I have the whole list of every single one. It's going to be crazy. I was actually, I'm super excited to do this. We just finished Fallout 4. I've been playing that on Sundays and Mondays in the mornings, but now that I've got some more time, I'm doing a couple night streams. So, oh, let's turn this, let's turn this up. Classic intro, love it. I didn't want to go too crazy on the uh, graphics because it's a pain in the butt to get the mods to want to work together. the border, right? Walk right into that Imperial ambush. Same as us. And that thief over there. Damn you Stormcloaks. Skyrim was fine until you came along. Empire was nice and lazy. If they hadn't been looking for you, could have stolen that horse and been halfway to Hammerfell. You there. You and me. We shouldn't be here. It's these Stormcloaks the Empire wants. We're all brothers and sisters in binds now, thief. Shut up back there. What's wrong with him, huh? Watch your tongue. You're speaking to Ulfric Stormcloak, the true High King. Ulfric? The Jarl of Windhelm? You're the leader of the rebellion. But if they captured you... Oh, gods. Where are they taking us? I don't know where we're going. But Sovereign Guard awaits. Oh, no. This can't be happening. This isn't happening. Never done this intro before. Not like 8,000 times. What village are you from, horse thief? Why do you care? A Nord's last thoughts should be of home. Rorikstead. I'm... I'm from Rorikstead. General Talia, sir. The headsman is waiting. Oh man, I haven't even decided what race I want to be. Last time we played through, I was an orc. Because I love the orcs. Maybe we'll be something else. Please help me. I guess with me and Spell Sword, Bren's pretty good. But, uh, but like Dark Elves are good. I 
I just feel like I have to be an orc. I don't know. Every time I play, I just have to. I always end up being an orc. <laughs> Get these prisoners out of the carts. Move it. Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Alrighty. Now we gotta decide. What do we wanna be? What do we wanna be? Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. No, wait! We're not rebels! Face your death with some courage, You've got to tell them! We worked with you! This is a mistake! Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time! Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak. That's funny because Ulfric. I have a list, but it's for books. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Rayloff of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No, Don't do it, rebel. man. You can't do this. Halt! Don't do it. You're not gonna kill me. Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. He didn't make it very far. Step four. Who are you? Who am I? That's a good question. Like I said. Oh, you know we could be in our. I don't know. I don't know. <clears throat> like I said, Dark Elves would be pretty solid. The Denmir are good. Um, I also, I like the Khajiit. I do like the Khajiit. Not really... I guess it doesn't really make sense, but... They're cool. I like the two that, like, everyone gives so much flack. <laughs> people, well, I guess people would like the Khajiit. It's mostly the orcs that people are just like, why are you playing as an orc? That's stupid. I like them. I like the way they look. I think they're cool. I don't know. Or we could just be a straight up Nord. You know? We could, we could go that route. Oh, man. A tough choice. The Brens are really good because they have the um, the dragon skin. Hmm. Like I said, I'm doing spell sword. This would be nice. The Berserker Rage wouldn't be bad though for just like mashing things, but Yeah, we're being an orc. Who am I kidding? Who am I kidding? Yeah, we gotta we gotta be beefy. If we're gonna be a spell sword. Well I guess we'd be we'd be uh Eh yeah, we'd be beefy. If we're gonna be hauling around a big old Big old sword. Complexion. Are we rugged and old? I feel like we are. If we're gonna know all this magical stuff. Scars? Kinda hard to see. Especially with that war paint. Yeah, I mean, he could have a, he could have a couple down his face, you know, nothing too crazy. All right, the war paint, the one that I like the most, either like the two eyes, 
I think that one's pretty sick. And this, the three dots. I think that's really cool looking. Kind of giving off like monk vibes. And then we'll go with that blood red. A, a crimson, we could say. I guess that's more of a crimson, but... Nose type. Can't have a big old beak, that's kind of weird. We want like a more normal looking nose. That one's not bad. Oh, there we go. That one's pretty good. A little, a little crooked, got in a couple, couple brawls. There we go. Jaw width? He's an orc, he's gotta have a big old jaw. Yeah. Oh, I like the... I like it back, kind of. Beak bones. You know, we're going to go through all this work and he's just going to be wearing a helmet the entire time. Or a freaking... A robe. We're never going to look at his face anyways. Beak bone color, doesn't matter. He doesn't have laugh lines. That's all good. He looks good how he is. Nice and rugged. The eyes, though, those make a big difference. I think I like the first one, honestly. Or that one. That one's okay. A little small, though. <laughs> that one's real small. That one's okay, too. I think the first one's the best, though. Do we want the red eyes? That is sick. The yellow is pretty good too. Could just be blind. That wouldn't make sense. We're trying to read all the books. How do we do that if we're blind? I think we'll go yellow. Drop the eyes down just a little bit. They looked a little funny being that high up. Probably pretty good. Depth. Uh, I like him a little more sunken back for the orc. Gotta have that big brow. Cool. That's what I'm talking about. The big old brow. He's gotta have big old. I don't like. I don't like the horn things. I'm not. I've never been a big fan. I don't think they look very good to me personally. I like the big eyebrows though. Boom. Pull those bad boys in. In and down. He looks angry. This is the brown. This is the most important. Forward. Mouth shape. Big old mouth. Uh, I feel like that last one was the best one. Pull that mouth down a little bit. Bring it forward. It's got to be a big protruding jaw. You know? Big chin. Oh, that's the other thing. Pull that chin forward. He's got those big old tusks. That'd be wild. How do they... How do they talk? Cohesively. With those giant tusks. Um, I feel like that's fine. Okay. Hair. This is a big, important one. I'm rocking the top knot. I guess you could say is what I'm have. So we could rock this, but this is a little more per further up than what I'm rocking. I feel like this is more more closer to what I have. But I'm rocking a bun. I guess we could go we can go with that ponytail. Oh man. You ever think you could rock something like that? Just full bald with just the tail? I don't think I could. I don't, I don't think I'd have it in me. Yeah, I think we're just gonna do the tail. Cool. Facial hair. 
Full beard, you know it. Hair color. Wouldn't be me if it's not red. Gotta be red. Is there a good red though? Like a like like that's more natural. Well, that's just like red. We I think we'd do that. Sweet. Finish a name. You know it. Crimson. Boom. You from one of the strongholds, Orc. How did you end up here? Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. We'll make sure your remains are turned to will send you. Follow the Captain, prisoner. Well. It is what it is. We made the character and now we're just gonna... We're just gonna get off. Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a Surprise. hero doesn't use a power like the Well, Vivi's probably in the other room hanging out with a partner. Throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. <laughs> what was that? It's nothing. That's a late night Very coffee. Yes, Not normally, uh. Place. Give them their last rights. Not normally what I do, but I also don't normally stay up until 11, so. Of the eight upon for the love of Talos, shut up. That's late for me anymore. I'm usually up early. As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. Uh-oh. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. Can you say the same? Don't look away. Give him the respect he deserves. You Imperian bastards! Justice! Death to the Stormcloaks! As fearless in death. I don't know who we're gonna side with either. That that's all stuff that I have not even decided. I haven't gotten close. Who I'm gonna side with? Like Obviously, we're going to have to head up to the College of Winterhold first. Probably going to be a pretty good thing to do. And just get that done. Get us, get all the good spells and stuff. Be smart. Uh, Goofy Goober? No, this is, uh, this is Skyrim. It's uh, Elder Scrolls. I'm just calling it a book collection simulator because that's what we're going to be doing. There's 337 books in the game and uh, I'm gonna collect them all at least try Elder Scrolls games are mostly just big high fantasy. But uh, there's a lot of books and a lot of them have lore. Whoa, we skip it. Good stuff. Um, they all have a bunch of lore that you can get into. And I love that. So uh, that's what we're doing. I've played through this game many, many times. But I've never done something like this. Uh, I don't know if there's an achievement, actually. It's just something I wanted to do for my personal achievements, I guess. Maybe there is. Uh, yeah, but like every time I played the game, I I really like actually like opening the books and reading them. They actually have a couple passages. Uh. Yeah. <clears throat> we're going this way. Uh, yeah, we're going this way. Doesn't really matter, but this is the way we're going. Um, we'll meet again 
Let's see. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. Got my binds. A dragon, no doubt. Let me be free. Just like the children's stories and the legends, the harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. Poor dude. There you go. You may as well take on your skier. <laughs> nice. So yeah, we have a couple. We have a couple mods that we're running just to do. Um, like I said at the beginning, um, a UI mod that they make things look a little bit nicer. And then we have a couple things to make collecting the books a little bit nicer um, and easier to see if we are missing one. It's going to have, they're going to be glowing. Um, going to see if I can find did I not pick these up? No, I did not. There we go. Uh, for boots, axe, boom. Look at that. Now we're cool. Uh, and then we have like the book covers and stuff that make it the books look nicer. And then we did a player home uh, mod that gives us like a a really nice fancy looking player house. <clears throat> And then uh, something to update our perks, because the the basic perks are fine in the game, but this one gives us a little bit nicer looking bells and stuff. So it should make the game a little bit a little bit more fun. Nice. But yeah, we're gonna do spell sword. So we're gonna use spells and probably one-handed swords. Something that usually doesn't really work that well in the basic game because the spells aren't amazing. There we go. And then we'll throw that on favorite. And our magic. I think we're probably going to use a lot of lightning. Lightning is one of my favorite. Fire is pretty good. Um, one, two, three. On. That way, I can just do quick swaps to my stuff. Let's go, Ralph. Go, go, go. too much off these guys. Most of it's just the same gear. We'll pick up some stuff to sell. But other than that. And we gotta, we gotta look through like freaking everything to get books. Grab some potions. Done. Let's get moving. We're done. They're fighting! Nice. No, I haven't seen him since the dragon. See, so that's part of the mon. The little blue glowiness on it. That means we haven't collected that one. So that's a book. Wait a second. We got one. Looks like there's something in this cage. Oh god. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, it's 
locked. See if you can get it open with some picks. We might need that gold once we get out. Grab anything useful and let's go. Boom. One out of 337. Look at that. We're on our way. We're on our way. There's another one. I'll try and update. My plan is to like... It'll probably be at the end of each session. I won't do it on stream, but... I'll go through my... Uh... Oh, that's nice. There's also a little star there. Um, Next to him. If I haven't collected it. But... We'll know because it'll be glowing. Pop this bad boy open. It's so weird going from Fallout to Skyrim being the fantasy stuff and the apocalyptic. I love both. Like, I love both. I prefer Skyrim just because I'm a fantasy, fantasy buff, but... There we go. Oh, we got some. We got some. Some goods. We are going to have to learn this book, which sucks. Then we're going to lose it. But. That's fine. Oh, there's a little eye next to him, too. Does that mean we haven't read them? Hmm. I haven't checked out what a lot of these mods do. Like, actually do in the game. I just know they're helpful for seeing if we have read books or not. Or gotten books. Nice. XP's XP. Yeah, this game's been around forever. I mean, they've remade it on every console since, like, the Xbox 360. <laughs> so, it's it's been around. They keep putting it out on every console until they make their new one. Because it was so loved. Got jokes that they just keep remaking it and remaking it. Yeah. Oh damn, we missed one. Leveling up is gonna be wild. I can't wait till we hit a level. We get a wall? Nice. Alright. And the funny thing is everyone plays the game because it's a broken way to play as an archer. Ranged. Stealth Archer is like the most broken. So broken. Goes. But I've never played as it. <laughs> I refuse. I mo most of the time when I play, I play as a, a sword and board. So I'll use a sword and a shield and just beat on things. But we're two hander. We're trying something new. I think it'll work out pretty well. I think we'll go into like conjuration and stuff and get summons. I think that'll help. And then we'll get like... Since we're probably gonna... Actually, I should put those on. Um, we're probably gonna be wearing novice. Or like, not, not novice. But we'll be wearing robes probably. A lot to help with our magic use and stuff. So we'll need alteration too. To give us extra armor and whatnot from spells. I think that'll be smart. Then we'll level up our one-hander too. Spiders! Burn them! 
I like the the health thing that they put in too for that that mod. Real nice. Magic is little. It sure is. But yeah, if you enjoy fantasy games, this is, and you haven't played any of the Elder Scrolls, like fantasy RPGs, fantastic. I'll always say it's great. It's one of the ones that, like, anyone that enjoys RPGs should check it out at some point in their life. Aye, aye, Captain. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Ocean? Nice. Oh, it feels it feels so good to be back. Back into the fantasy. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna tangle with it. Give me that wine. Watch where you step. Gotta sell all this stuff. Or if you feel lucky, you can take this flow. Might take her by Yeah, right. I'm not scared. Yeah. Why would we be scared of a Wait, how many books do we have? I didn't even update it. Oh no. Three. We got rid of that one. Boom. Sweet. Oh, did we get sparks too? Oh, let's switch over to sparks. Heck yeah. Love it. It drains magic, which is good for later on. And uh, I just think it looks cool. I feel like a Sith. Like a Sith Lord. We are not doing survival mode. Survival mode would be cool to play through sometime, but uh, it would make this run pretty tough. So we are not doing it. Wait. <laughs> so we're going to head down to the actual start. We'll do that. But, I just want to show you. This is our player home. It's way over here. It's called Itzy Tower. So we'll, we'll, I think we can fast travel there right now. But, for the time being, we'll go do the, the quest. Like he's gone for good this time. We'll keep doing the quest. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. We better clear out of here. My sister, nice. Murder. Runs the mill in Riverwood, just up the road. I'm sure she'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help today. Good luck. We should split up. As we run together. We should split up. Ooh, alchemy's gonna be really good too. I love alchemy. Man. I feel like we're going to be in this playthrough for a long time. That's fine. I love it. I love playing Skyrim, so... I could sink an unfathomable amount of hours into this game. What's that? An elk. That ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. I never understood how my sister could stand living in the shadow of that place. What do you mean? I guess you get used to it. I think it looks kind of cool. Like... You know what I mean? It looks pretty cool. Are we supposed to be splitting up?
Okay. So I think... Since the majority of what we're going to do is going to be spells. So we probably will use the Mage Stone. These probably. are the Guardian Stones. The sword is just going to be there as something that we can beat on things with. Go ahead. See for yourself. Uh, the Mage Stone. So this, those under the sign of the Mage, will learn magic skills 20% faster. So that's really nice. We'll get a level of our magic stuff really quick. Well, to each his own. It's not for me to judge. This will just level up, like, using your weapon more, faster, armor, all that stuff. Um, lock skill, things like that. So the skills, like I said, they're crazy. Like, we got the thing that makes them way different. So we're going to have to figure out what we want to go into. Is like, destruction projectile spells interrupt targets that are casting a spell. Like, that's kind of nuts. And then you go in here. If wearing robes and no light or heavy armor, your spells are more powerful. So you, you take the less armor and you're just way stronger. But then we'll go down... We'll probably go down this because I think this is the lightning one. Shock spells have 20% more powerful. That's pretty good. Shock spells leave their target 75% health. Leave their target above 75% health. Uh, deal enough additional damage to make up that difference. Oh, man. Yeah, so they just like start doing crazy things. Which a bunch of this is not in the base game. Hitting targets that are non fire resistance cause plasma damage. Deal fire. Holy crap. Shock spells have 15% chance to lift the target in the air? You know, some of these things are crazy. Dual casting six shock spells in combat trigger... Oh, well, we're not going to be... We're not going to be dual casting, so we're not going to need that one. Shock spells incapacitate living targets below 25%. Dang, so that, like, stuns people once you drop them down low? Brain more magic. That's really good. Storm blast. You accumulate static energy from the ambient air. Every 6 to 12 seconds in combat, your next shock spell triggers a ground discharge that radiates outward. Dang. Absolute power. Aiming sparks, lightning bolt, chain lightning, thunderbolt, and lightning storm spell directly at a target will magnetically levitate them in front of you for 6 seconds. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. I wonder what, um... Huh. I mean, we're going to have to actually look through all this stuff. Because maybe fire is going to be sick. Maybe, um, like, freezing people. Maybe that's what that does. Frost spells immobilize targets in a block of ice. That's nuts. Crazy. Shatter... Frost spells hit that hit a frost resistant target fragment and explode. Dang. I don't know. Maybe we want to go frost. This drains stamina, which is really good too, because there's a lot of melee. A lot of melee enemies in the game. Uh but fire spells just do straight up more damage. So fire is crazy too. We'll have to figure out what we want. You may choose one element. Spells and effects of that element are... Oh, see? This is nice. Yeah. So we're going to specialize. We pick that up. Which I think we are. We're going to pick one and, and like that's going to be our thing. So we'll have to figure that out. Conjuration. Let's take a look at this. See, I want to look through all these because I haven't. I feel like Conjuration is going to be pretty cool. Summon a Daedra and other... Non-undead minions. When I when I played the first time, all we were doing was able to summon like the um the elemental things, which was cool. 
and zombies and stuff like that, but that seems really cool. Bound weapons. That's another thing. We could go the bound weapon route. Feed the monster. You're able to feed human flesh to summoned or reanimated creatures. That's wild. That's wild. Rat King? Oh no. When entering combat, creates three undead skeevers under your control. Hydration sounds pretty sick. The only other thing I ever wanted to do in this game, which I think we would have to use these perks for, is being like a stealth illusion person and using illusion to like be able to backstab with daggers. I think that would be like one of the coolest ways to play this game. Um, but we're not going to do that this round. We're going Destro. Probably Alteration. Because that'll give us uh, stuff. Maybe some enchanting. No smithing, no heavy armor, no block. Um, oops. Sorry, we're getting carried away with the skills, but it's fine. I want to look at them. One hand we're going into. Um, Furious Strength. Power attack with one-handed weapon increased. Yeah, we're going to grab that. Overrun. One-handed sprinting power attack that deals up to 50% more damage. Dang. And then we pick a weapon in this just like the the spells. Um, so there's axes. Those do like bleeding damage. Uh, maces ignore armor. And swords, I think, just do more raw damage. Oh, it also makes bleeds. Hmm. Whenever you defeat at least four humanoids and or animals in a single combat, you gain a permanent plus one. Dang. That's crazy. Unleash the beast? Oh, that's dual wheel. Okay. That's cool. That's gonna be sweet. It's, it makes one-handed weapons, or like just using weapons in general, way better. Cool. And then speech is really nice to get up. Um, but yeah. We'll figure it out. Man. That makes me, makes me wonder. I feel like, since we're doing spells, like Spell Sword, I think Frost might be the best. And we can freeze and get up and just bash on people. That might be the route we go. We might be a Frost. Remember, frost Wizard. Oh. Hey. Whoa. Go out, bud. I thought we were supposed to split up. I got way too excited about this, the, the perks, but that's good. It's going to be fun. Let's keep going, bud. What's taking you so long? I wonder what the... Uh, sorry, last time. I didn't see the alchemy. Ah, here it was. Right after speech. Because this is something that that I thought was cool even before. Beneficial potions or ingredients you regenerate 2% of your ma So that makes them stronger. Stimulants also increase movement speed. That's kind of cool. Lab Skeever. For 20 seconds after using the alchemy lab, beneficial potions... Oh, so once you... If you're using a lab, it makes them stronger. That's cool. <laughs> that which does not kill you. Upon learning this perk, you imbibe a deadly toxin taking 150 damage per second. If you survive, you receive three perk points and permanent 25... Wow. 
So pretty much if you have over 150 health, you drink that. And then you get a permanent bonus. That's kind of crazy. You just like get yourself stronger to poison. Damn. We're gonna have way too much fun with this. Modded Skyrim makes it fun. It's fun before. If you're not if you're just playing regular, but. Alright, Wolfies. Where you at? Oh. We'll probably go into just enough healing to make us be able to use the fast heal. Maybe? I don't know. Maybe we'll just go down the potions route. I'm glad you decided to come with me. We're almost to Riverwood. Gotta collect flowers. Picking flowers. But yeah, like, the other add-ons that are just, like, basic, it makes the game run so much smoother. Just, it, it looks so much cleaner than when you're, nor when you're playing without them. It's amazing. I'm really glad that I got them to work. Because the, the first time I tried forever ago, it was rough. And I've got better things to do than listen to more of your fantasies. You'll see. It was a dragon. It'll kill us all, and then you'll believe me. Feel it? Okay, so we're supposed to go talk to. Feindall thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already cousin? mine. I keep telling you. Sister? I don't remember now. This lady. You must be one of those wizards from the college in Winterhold. Well, I am not. Um, thank you for noticing my wonderful garb, though. Rayloff? I know I look fancy. How do you know him? Uh, how do I know him? Um, he's a friend. You really are Rayloff's friend. Just a I'd friend. Glad to help you, but you didn't answer my question. We didn't almost get our head chopped off together. A dragon in Helgen? It can't be. Although, it would explain what I saw earlier. Flying down the valley in the south. I thought I must have just been seeing things. It was a dragon. I don't know why, but I actually believe you. You've got the look of someone who's just seen a dragon. Things just go from bad to worse. I did. First the war, now dragons. What's this world coming to? The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. I can do that. Brother, Mara's oh, mercy, yeah. you're safe. There he is. Your friend told me about Helgen. But is it safe for you to be here? Gerda. Won't the Imperius be looking for you? Safe is a questionable Fine. word. At least now I am. Is there somewhere we can talk? There's no telling when the news from Helgen will reach the Imperials. You're right. Don't need Follow that me. out. Hold. Wait a minute. I need your help with something. Okay. What is it, woman? Stand drunk on the job again? Hold. Just come here. Raylo, what are you doing here? Ha. I'll be right down. Oh, we're gonna talk. We're gonna talk over here. We're not going inside your house. I'm glad to help any way I can. Do you have any supplies? I'd love to take them. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. Help yourself to whatever you need within reason. I will take all of them. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Most of this, I already know. I mean, I don't get the white run. It's down the road. Hmm. 
Okay. Here for work. What do you think Get about the war? Bring me all the wood you can chop. I. I am not. I'm sorry. Um, I'm a wizard. I'm not here to chop wood. Aw, doggy. I love the dogs. I don't like the children. Well, one of us has to do something. The children in this no. game are no abysmal. No theatrics, no thief chasing. They're all rude. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. Sorry you had to hear that. <clears throat> do you have any books for sale? Any books? Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still... Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. I would like to buy books, please. All of you. Oh, well. Fishing map doesn't really... That's not a book. These do count as books, though. I'm almost... Po well... I don't know. I'll have to look at the book, the book list. I don't know if the spell tomes do. Either way, we're going to have to get them... Oh no, I'm poor. Um, let me sell first. I'm wearing those, but I didn't... I wasn't going to wear anything because I want that one perk, but we don't have it yet. So, I can still wear some stuff. These are all equipped, that's fine. Get rid of those. Weapons, I only need one sword. I don't need arrows. And those. Cool. Uh, that's all for making potions. We're good. Uh, I don't need a lantern. This UI makes this game look so much more beautiful. Like, it, make, it makes it so much easier to navigate, especially on PC. What's he got? Okay, books. Um, Oak Flesh is going to be really nice. We're definitely going to want that. Raised Zombie, kind of a bad... Um, kind of a bad summon, but it gives us at least something to work on XP for now. Um, there's, oh no, frostbite. How much do we have? We only have 10 gold. Uh, crap. What if I sell these? I'm still poor. Um, oh, here we go. We can sell this stuff. Potion of health, we don't need. Potion of stamina. 101? No. Dang it. We're so close. Did something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a... I guess we don't need it right this second, but... We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. I can help you get it back. You could. I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Aye, aye. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northwest of town. So this is your plan, Logan? That's not what I want. Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Nope, he doesn't. He doesn't have to go. Stay. Don't follow me. Um, so Bleak Falls Barrow is here, and that's where it wants us to go. And then the main quest, Head to Whiterun, is over here. The thing I want to do, I want to go check out the Itzy Tower. Because I love this place. Might as well show it off. Now that we've been in Riverwood, we can just jump back. So this is way out here. 
This is our, our player home from the mod. It is on top of a giant mud crab. We live on a mud crab, and I, I think it's amazing. I think it's super fitting for our wizard. I think it's so cool looking. I tried to find other ones that were like, maybe like a giant library or stuff like that, but this one seemed really cool. And it has a good amount of bookshelves in it, so we'll be able to store all of our books. And it's just got cool stuff in it. I mean, it just looks cool. It's got a whole potion lab. So this is going to be home base for the for the entire run. Got a couple mannequins so we can set stuff up to look cool. Uh, it's got an oven. All that good stuff. We even have... Where is he at? Is he upstairs? I can hear him. Oh, there he is. We even have our own little mud crab pet. He's so cute. And he burrows in the floor. Ow! I have no idea. Don't know, but he's cute. This is just all a, a, a aesthetic. Which is pretty cool looking. I enjoy it. Uh, the upstairs here. Has some chests. Uh, we can plant some stuff here. Has a bunch of papers and stuff for aesthetic stuff. More chests, which is good. Lots and lots of chests for storing things. That'll be handy. Normally you don't have something like this and you have to buy your own house and get it all set up and all that, but we wanted to get a fancy looking one. There's a player room. Sleep in the bed. Wardrobe, all that good stuff. I don't think we're going to be using that one. That goes out the bottom. This, oh wait, no. This goes downstairs. You, I think it's a bathroom. And if, if this crashes, I'm sorry. Some of this stuff is not perfectly stable. Yeah, it's just like a cool looking bathroom. Like a bath. Just aesthetic. Um... I think I had it running pretty smooth though, so it shouldn't shouldn't crash. Book uh bookcases. I don't think we're gonna use those ones because they don't show it. But this is a good room for us, like our our bedroom. We have like a weapon stash. We have gold gems. A wardrobe here. Armor shelf. And there's weapon plaques so we can put stuff up. That'll look cool for, like, special weapons that we get. This is where the books are. We have staff things, but we have tons of bookshelves. I think there's, like, two or three levels in this. So this will be nice. We can store all of our books. Two. Yeah. Two levels of bookshelves. And I have the mod that makes you... So you can stack the full amount of books. Um on here, which is really nice, so. One, two, three. For now. That's it. We got three books so far. Let's, uh, let's read these ones. And then we'll throw these on. Yeah, I don't think we're going to use healing. I think we'll use potions. But that goes up one more to the next one. Oh, this goes outside, too. There's more planting stuff that we can do out here. Teleports caster to... It. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know they put that book in. A spell to just teleport us back. I mean, we can fast travel, but... I guess if we're somewhere where we can't fast travel, we can just teleport out. Pretty nifty. We have an enchanting table here. Spider experiments. Huh. I wonder if that's part of the... Part of the mod. 
I've never seen that book before. Pillows? You can sleep up here? That's pretty cool. And then there's all these bookshelves too. So I think we'll have enough space for 300. Um, box of plenty. Spawns a spider that can be used to haul items. Those are cool. They're just like little pets you can have. That's really cool. Then we can just jump down. So that's the house. I think it looks freaking sweet. I think it'll be a good home base. We're gonna have to name our uh, mud crab. Maybe we'll just name him Krabby. Maybe he'll make the noise. Yeah, we're like right in the middle of the big old swampy area. Um, Riften's down here. Windhelm's here. So, pretty sweet. I like I like that. I think it's a cool idea to have a nice nice player base to to set up shop. I think that'll be good for collecting all the books. Fancy robes. You a wizard or something? <laughs> He's got a good eye. Yeah, I think we're going to do frost. I think that sounds like a freaking sweet idea. The melee. But then we have this. Freaking stone flesh. Or no, oak flesh. This gives you extra armor, which will be really nice. It'll be like having medium armor, or light armor, or heavy armor, whatever. Um... Then we can raise zombie. Right now we can zap. Let's go. Let's go do Bleak Falls Barrow. Find some cool stuff up there. Oh! God! Came out of nowhere. Bad out of hell. Fallout 4, the ending was so good. I had such a such a good time playing through as the Brotherhood. I'm happy that we went that route. The ending was really good. It was it was much more satisfying than than the railroad one. So that was that was freaking great. Executions are, are satisfying. But yeah, since we're not, we don't have that one thing yet to make us do more damage with our spells. So, throw those on for now. Give us a little bit more armor. We have this at day three. Nice. Alteration. Boom! XP. Getting alteration XP already. Out. Do we level? Yes. Now we get to put that point in. 
This is what I'm talking about. Every time we level up, we get health, magic, stamina, whatever we want. Um, I feel like for a baseline, we're going to probably want like 200 stamina just to have like a decent amount. And then it'll give us a little bit more carry weight. Um, health. Magic will probably go up to like 300 and then the rest is just going to go on health. That's my kind of overall plan. We'll see how much mana we want and whatnot. But um, let's go magic for now, since we're going going that route. Uh, first things first. Destruction. I feel like is important. We want to get this. Plus, this will just make us do more damage. Yeah. Destruction spells cost 35% less and do more damage. Kinda nuts. Kinda nuts. We're just gonna take a bunch of this stuff. Load up good. Oh yeah. This is the fun thing. Oh wait, no. Wrong thing. Cancel. Four? Yeah. You're mine. Come with me. That's the only reason Ray Zombie is, is amazing. Come with me, my minion. Cool. <laughs> uh. Love it. Love it. I feel like this is just a tad bright. We're gonna... Whoops. I do There we go. There we go. I'm so used to playing in the morning that all my light settings and stuff... I'm set for the... Having the, the bright lights outside, like the sunlight and stuff. Coming into the room. I have to adjust a little bit. Start, starting to get a little darker out now. That's oh, eight. Yeah, new schedule is uh, all set up. We're going to be doing um, Get out of here. Mondays, like normal, 8 to 11 in the morning. Uh, central. This is all Central Daylight Time. Uh, 8 to 11 in the morning. And then uh, Tuesday off. Wednesday and Thursday will be our nighttime streams. We're going to be doing 7 p.m. until 10 p.m. Uh, central Daylight Time as well. And then... Uh, Friday morning, we'll be back right away. Um, same thing as eight, our 8 a.m. time. Um, until 11. And then Saturday off and Sunday as usual. 8 a.m. Where is this guy at? 8 a.m. to 11. We're picking up one more morning stream and then two night streams. I'm excited. We're going to get really into this book stuff. And then uh, two of the days we're going to be doing um, Final Fantasy 13. We're going to start a playthrough of that too. Just to mix up the Skyrim. Always nice to have something else to be working on too. I thought about playing um, Cyberpunk. Because we started that a while ago and never uh, got around back to it. And I didn't get that far in, so I'd probably just start over. But maybe that'll be after we finish Final Fantasy. It's been a really long time since I've played through 13. And I want to play through it again. To get the story again. And I never played the other two. I got steel. 
Because there's three Final Fantasy 13 games, which is nuts. They're kind of like DLCs, but... So I want to I wanna play through it. I want to see the story again. Like really get into it. See if I really do enjoy it. Because when I, when I played through it as a kid, it didn't strike me as, as heavy as the other ones. And so I just, I want to see if I genuinely enjoy it. And I probably will. I'm not going to say it's going to be my favorite Final Fantasy because 9 is my favorite. By far. Um, you know. I'll, I'll probably still enjoy it. I know that one's a little more torn on the fan base. Um, there are people that absolutely adore that game. There are people that do not. So we'll figure out which one we are. It'll be a nice breakup too from the actiony stuff. It's still turn. That one's turn based. It it was like when they were trying to get into doing action stuff because. Uh, 15 after that was their, their big action break. This guy is freaking buff. Get out of here. Do you have a good weapon? Steel sword, hell yeah. Um. We have the imperial sword. I guess the steel sword is the same. We're not an Imperial, though. I actually have no idea if we're going to be an Imperial. But, oh, I didn't want to favorite that. Steel Sword. That's what I wanted. Um, yeah, nice. Okay. Yeah, it'll be a, a nice breakup. Between the action-y stuff, going to doing like a, a turn-based, more story stuff. I mean, obviously we're going to get a ton of lore and, and love it from this, but... Alright, what do we got? Snake. Snake, snake, dolphin. Yep. I'm surprised I don't have these memorized. But I am going on vacation starting tomorrow. I'll be back on s Monday. Um, and then we'll be, we'll be, I think through, oh, look at that. Look at that, that's a book. Um, that's a book. Let's see, number four. Um, Yeah, like I said, uh, we'll be back Monday, and then we'll play Wednesday, Thursday, and I think that's the last day, Thursday, I want to say, because we're moving uh, next week. Skeevers! Oh, here we go, here we go. This is the good stuff. Get him, my Skeever Pokemon! Go! Where is he? What are you doing? Get him! Pokemon battle, go! Worthless. Rattata sucks. Um, but yeah, we're moving into a new house. We're staying in the same area. But, uh... Ooh, new, new house. Really excited for that. I'll be gone for a couple more days. Just getting moved in, or getting moved out of this place, and then moved into a new place, and, and getting internet set up, and all that good stuff. But after that, the schedule will be solid, and, and we'll be just playing five days a week. I'm really excited. Really excited. I'll have my own space. I think I'm going to pick up a green screen, so we're going to rock the green screen. Um... So that'll be cool. There's a chest. You always gotta check 
check under the cobwebs. Sometimes there's chests. Oh, ski for man dying. Freaking Rattata. So yeah, once we get into August, the schedule will be real good. This guy has some hell. He is a beef cake. A beefcake. Throw that up. Oh, we leveled. Oh, he's poisoning us. Nice. Yeah, we took some damage there. Let's level. I think that heals us, yeah. Um, let's go in here so we're at 150. That'll feel good. And then we can go... We can start going maybe health to get a little bit more health. That's going to take up to 20. So we're going to have to level our destruction some more. Hmm. Maybe alteration? Will this cost less? That'd be pretty good. Mage armor, what's that? Protection spells are 100% stronger if not wearing armor. Oh, that's going to be good. That's going to make us so strong. Mm-hmm. 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 I'll be over there in a second, bud. We, we gotta, we gotta loot. Looting is important. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm gonna get these spider eggs. You, over here. And the three gold. It's important. Okay, this guy's this guy's a jerk. Now cut me down before anything else shows up. He's a freaking jerk. Yes, the claw. I know where's how the, it works. Where's the claw? The claw, the markings, the door, and the hall of stories. I know how they all fit together. Help me down, and I'll Do show you. Do you? You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden there. Hand over the claw. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. Fine, fine, fine. It's coming loose. I can feel it. You fool. Why should I share the treasure with that? Well, screw you then. Jerk. I don't think journals count. I don't think they count. Pick these urns really quick. Nope. Nope. Nice, okay. Yeah, I don't I don't think those count. But let's read his let's read his journal. We haven't read any books yet. Actually read them. So let's let's read this. Get a little bit of lore on lore on our guy. My fit let's see. My fingers are trembling. The golden claws finally in my hands. And with it the power of the ancient Nordic heroes. That fool Luke and Valerius had no idea that his favorite store decoration was actually the key to Be Bleak Falls Barrow. Now I just need to get to the Halls of Stories and unlock the door. The legend says there's a test that the Nords put in place to keep the unworthy away. But that when you have the Golden Claw, the solution is in the palm of your hands. That tells you that you do this. You look at this. Boom. One, two, three. We got we got markings there. Bear, moth, owl. Frickin' Draugr, man. 
You know what? They're always here. They're always down here. Always creeping. Always creeping, man. Always creeping. How's our our weight looking? Oh, we're at 130, so we can we can grab some of this stuff. This is Excuse me. This is free money. Free money. Yeah, that's a that's a trap. Walk around that. Oh man. Eat lightning. Ooh. Yeah, frost will be cool. The only thing that sucks about frost is a lot of things are resistant to it, but once you get that perk, then it starts like blowing up on things. So maybe that'll be good. Um, oceans. Favorite our healing potion, and then six. Get destruction. Yeah, I think we're going to have fun once we get higher. Once we get higher, it's going to be good. We're going to be freaking blasting people. Oh, another chest. This one's an apprentice. Nice. Leveling up that lock picking. Whew, we made it. Yeah, the alteration. Love it. Getting tons of XP. Bone meal, I like it. Oh, here we go, here we go. Come on, bud. I got this. A little plan here. Bam. I didn't get him. Vivi's buffing. Thank you. He's normally pretty quiet, but sometimes people are loud going up the stairs and stuff in the hallway. Sometimes she'll buff. He's a pretty good dog, though. He is a pretty good doggy. Oh, right, we leveled? Yes. Okay, we're gonna go, we're gonna start getting some health, just so we don't, not so squishy. We're not getting blasted. Um, we can go into here again. Which will make it 50% less. Which will be nice. What's this? This is at 30. Elemental spells and effects cost 30%. A cast in favorable weather. 
Oh. That's kind of cool. But then we'll get this. And. Oh, God. That's not what I wanted. Elemental specialization. That's for. Oh, my God. That's way later. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. But. We can pick one here. So this makes us um, do more damage with frost. Which I think we're going to go. I'm like, it's going to be really good against um, all the melee in the game. I think that's going to be good. Once we get out of here, we'll pick up the frost spell. Did we pick up another book? I don't think we did. I think we're still at four. I think we are still at four. to sell. I was really hoping we'd find a book of Ross maybe down here, but you know, sometimes it's just random. You don't get you don't get certain things, so Yes, I like to troll you. Sometimes it'll just give you nothing. Couple scrolls though, that's pretty good. Money. Free money. Bye bye. Skeever tail. Give me them goods. Yo, we were stocking up on lockpicks, though. That's kind of nice. Usually I struggle in the beginning of, uh... The beginning of Skyrim with lockpicks. Not this run. We'll see, though. Maybe we'll start breaking them. <laughs> That's... Leveling up with your lockpicking is good, but I don't know. Kind of like a last thing that I do. Because you can open everything. That's the difference about this and, and Fallout. You can open everything. It just sometimes it sucks. Sometimes you break like six locks, you know, or lockpicks, you know? Sometimes you just break everything. It's a big boy! A big beefy boy! We're just gonna zap him. Get that free damage. Oh, I'm so used to playing Elden Ring. We gotta get those jump attacks in. Get out of here! Uh, we're gonna have to play a little... <laughs> a little different, I think, until we get beefy. Um... Because I'm so used to being so tanky, having like heavy armor and a shield, and we're going to have to play a little different. Dang. It's right there. Oh, that hunting bow, we'll sell that. That's our weight at. Yeah, we're getting a little heavy. 
Little heavy. Okay, what? Can we make it? I'm hiding. I'm hiding. Aha, see, he's dumb. Did he walk in there and get... Oh, what a poor fool. That's pretty funny, though. <laughs> he walked in and killed himself. Oh, the Draugr. Not the brightest, huh? Not the brightest. Let's get some sneak XP. Bam! Nice. Okay. Bear? Bear? Moth? Owl? Nice. The speedrun of this game. They've broken this game so much, it's absolutely wild to watch. Absolutely wild. I don't know how they do it. Oh no. We don't have a pickaxe. That's okay, we're not gonna be- we're not gonna be blacksmithing. It's a good way to get free XP, but... chests in here. Where are they at? In the water? Oh, there it is. I knew it. I remembered. One gold! Yep. I don't, that's that's good old Skyrim. Good old chest trolling. What's in here though? Oh, a spell, candlelight, amethyst, iron warhammer. Okay. A gem, a poison. Soak up this goodness. Unrelenting force. Hi, bud. Good morning. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I used the wrong spell. Do I have... Do I have any magic push? I do. Okay. Thank God. Suck him down. Don't you do that! No pusher die. I am sip.
No, we're just overweight. Oh my gosh, Vivi. Give me one second. He's buffing. Sit. I just realized. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. He's done buffing. Let's drop something quick. We're way too heavy. Get rid. We can chuck something. For boots. Perfect. Uh, high bracers. Feel too heavy. Now we're good. All right. Oh. Let's get out of here. Pretty good first dungeon. Pretty good first dungeon. Thank you for the hydrate. Grab these purple flowers. A little skull. You never know when you're going to need it. Out to Skyrim. Some blood down there. Back to Riverwood? Nice. We go sell some stuff too. Awesome. Hey, bud. Sooner you don't let my sister do anything foolish. I have the golden claw. You found it. <laughs> there it is. Strange. It seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> funny thing, huh? Super I'm funny. Put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Well, maybe if you didn't have it sitting on the front desk. People wouldn't try and steal it. Thank you so much for Billy taking man. care of the trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Billy man. Okay, we have a lot of stuff we can sell. Amethyst, that's money. Oh, we got speech. And we got a level. Yes. We got lots of stuff we can sell. The um the ancient we'll keep this because we'll we'll uh, disenchant that later. How much money has he got? He's got a decent bit. Nice. Thank you for the money. Increases speech skill by 20. Dang. Sell those. I think we're doing pretty good. We don't need these skulls, though. Honestly, we don't need those ingots, either. Uh, he's out of money. It's fine. Um, though... Mr... I would like to buy your books. And you know what? We'll get your fishing map too. Why not? Why not? And we'll give you back some of your money. Um. Candlelight. Clairvoyance. Frostbite. Fury. Perfect. We got them all. We're becoming a wizard. I'm a wizard, Harry. 
Nope. Frostbite. We're going frost. We are going frost. Um, let's see, that's so good. Unread books glow. Oh, it's unread books. Hmm. So we are going to have to read the books. That way we know we've got them. But that's okay. Nice. Um, two. Oak flesh is three. Raise zombie. We're honestly like probably not gonna use this. Let's be real. Until we learn like the summon familiar. Probably not gonna be doing much of that for now. Uh go magic. Probably turn that off. Here, boom. Level up. Uh, we'll grab a little bit more health this round. Okay, so do we go into here? That's probably smart. We can't go higher. But at the same time. Do we want to start going into like one handed? That's going to be useful. Do a little bit more damage with our weapon, stuff like that. Um, the other thing that's useful is speech. And then alchemy is probably going to be useful because we're going to be. Where's that? How do I always miss it? Right here. Um. It makes your potion stronger. So that's going to be really good. Stuff like that. Eating an ingredient reveals all... Ex that's really good. I don't know. Let's check out alteration. What, what can we get in here? We can get a mage armor thing. This would be really good. That's, that's going to be handy. That'll make us... A little bit tankier. Won't have to worry as much. Alright. What do we got? We literally just have Talk to the Arrow. Sounds good. I guess we could go. Eh, let's go to White Run. It's gonna be important. Get that done. It's gonna be important. He's so fast! Don't you do it. Don't you do it, wolves. Get out of here. Alright. Down the hill. So who's this guy? Hello. I'm on my way to Windhelm to join up with the Stormcloaks. Ulfric has the right of it. All right. Good luck. Good luck. We might be there at some point. I don't know. Down the hill. 
Into the farms? Yeah, we're going to Whiterun. Good oh well. Playing. Look strong. Come well, that's taken care of. No thanks to you. Um. Certainly not. But a true warrior. You didn't need my help. The opportunity to take on a giant. That's why I'm here with my shield brothers. What's a shield brother? An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Can I join you? Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Codlack Whitemane up in Yurvaskar. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your worth. Okay. If you go to him, good luck. I'm here to help. That'll be a maybe. Maybe we'll do that. I'll take these cabbages just on the way. Cabbage thief. Man, it's already nine. Can't believe it. We're sunk so so deep into the game. A nip in the air. Cold won't be good for my crops. I have cabbage to sell. For honest work. It might be your cabbages. Honest pay for honest work. <laughs> you should buy some produce from. Car good to have you by my side, friend. I need reliable people around. Thanks, man. Thanks, my guy. My good friend. For the money that I pretty much stole. Oh. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. I am official. Fine, but we'll be keeping an eye on you. Two. I am a wizard. Well, I am high and mighty. Takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane? My short. I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's storm cloak. Yeah. Besides, Greymane would never make steel. Because I'm not wearing shoes. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Damn those Greymanes to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks. They'll get what's coming to them. Yep, they will. Maybe. I don't know. Got to get the flowers. Okay, we're supposed to go to the Arl. Up to the Arl. Get this main quest. Main quest going. Then we'll do some exploring. See if we can find some books. So we've only gotten four. We have so many to get. I don't even know if there's going to be books that are, like, difficult to get. I haven't... I haven't done anything like this before. Hard to believe, isn't it? My lord, please. What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgraf is not receiving visitors. I just... Well... Who's this, then? Yeah, let's tell him that Gertrude... As House Carl, my job is to deal with all us. dangers that threaten the Jarl or his people. So you have my attention. Now explain yourself. A dragon. There was a dragon. You know about Helgen? The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Approach. Oh, hi, Vivi. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? I did. Well, um... Let's go at... Well, I don't... It doesn't matter. 
Let's not tell him that we were getting our head cut off. By Ismir, Irileth was right. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... The Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, Good on you, Belgrave. Send to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. Well done. You've done White Run a service. And I won't forget it. Here. What do we get? A a steel armor. My steam. There is That's not useful to me. another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come. Let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors. Of Your court dragons. wizard. After you. Onward. Oh, this they have so many books here. Is it am I stealing? Oh, we're gonna get some books. Faringar, I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon. So many project. books. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch. I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Um. Where am I going? What am I fetching? Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave you already those have details this. to your betters, am I right? I uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow, a dragon stone. Said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Ah. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Yes, the yes. Simplicity itself. You mean this one? This one that I already have? Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. I'm a genius. You already found it. You are cut from a different cloth than the usual brutes they are foists on me. Dun -dun -dun. Um. I got you the dragon stone. What's next? That is where your job ends and mine begins. The work of the mind, sadly undervalued in Skyrim. I'm a wizard. Can you not tell? I'm a oh, wizard. No. What? Yes. Barangar, you need to come at once. A dragon's been sighted nearby. Not a dragon. You should come too. A dragon. How exciting. Where was it seen? Well, okay, well before you? that, I have I something to disenchant. It's a bit more seriously if I were you. Um. The dragon decides to attack Whiterun. I don't know if we can stop gem. it. Oh, disenchant. Okay, sweet. It's just on disenchant. Nice. I'm going to have to get used to that. We get rid of this. Boom. Thank you. Uh, and we can't, we can't enchant those because they already are. So, perfect. Hmm. I'll take that. And that. <clears throat> Those are mine. Oh, 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 look at all the books. Oh, baby. Okay, we're going to have to... We're going to have to count. What do we got? Nords of Skyrim. I'll take you. That's one. Healing before you're killed. That's two. Biography of Baron Zaya. Volume three. Songs of Return. Volume seven. I was not counting. Uh oh. Four, five. Six. 
Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Well, and a quest thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Eighteen, nineteen, twenty. We're gonna have to double check and make sure I don't have extra books. But twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. 27, 28. Thank you, Mr. Wizard, for all of your books. Okay. So 28 plus 4, that's 32. We're at 32. That's, uh, oopsies. Boom. That's nice. We get we get a big old jump head start because of everything this man has. Oh, the song of return. Is that a new one? Nope, that was not. Okay. So that's an extra one. All of those were uh, not repeats though. That's pretty good. Pretty good start. Maybe he's got some more in his in his office in here. Or his bedroom, whatever it is. Nope. Okay. I know there's more books over here. Are these different ones? Oh my gosh. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, seven more, thirty-nine. Oops. Good start. Maybe we should go take on this dragon. Well, oh, that's awesome. We're at thirty-nine out of three hundred thirty-seven. There we go. There's another book. Actually, we might have read this already. Black arrow. We might have that one. See, I can't I can't remember if the eye stays on there. If we have read it. If that's what it is. I feel like it it is. We'll we'll have to see what that actually does. I think I think it's if it's been read. But I can't be for certain. We have a ton of books to drop off. Let's go over to Itzy Tower and drop these books off so we don't forget about it. Let's say weigh us down. Back to the home base. put our first books right here on this bookshelf we're gonna have to uh, actually organize them brief history 
Oh no, that was the wrong thing. I put some bear claws on there. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. Okay. Sweet. I think there was one repeat book that we had. Let's take that off of there. We don't need that. But I think that's it. Just one repeat. Oh god, did we break it? Did we go too fast? <laughs> oh no. I think we went too fast. Okay, I think there's too many books on the bookshelf. Let's take a couple off and see if it fixes it. A little bit better. I don't know how many it holds. Still being wonky. Why are you being silly? There's also a note in here. Oh, whoops. The fish. The fishing. Put the fishing thing in there. Maybe that's messing it up. No. Darkest darkness. There we go. Maybe those ones are just weird. I think they're looking funny, but that's fine. Yeah. Maybe we'll have to take that one off. I think it's the book skins that are, that are causing it problems. Just maybe. Yeah, it might, that might be what, what is causing it problems. They're dancing. It's fine. Yeah, we'll we'll look into that that uh that mod. Because most of them work. Most of them look good. Uh oh. That's a that's a good looking bookshelf right there. Yep. Yep. It's really jammed. We jammed her tight. Two more books. Did I put that in there? I did. I damn it. Alright. Quality. I am the most amazing at stacking books. Good stuff. We got 39 now. Okay. That's all I wanted to do. Now we have to head back and kill this dragon. Kill us a dragon.
Yeah, I know we're supposed to kill a dragon, but the butterflies. No signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. And if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere, spread out and look for survivors. We need to know what we're dealing with. We must know what we're dealing with. Probably a dragon. No, get probably. Back. It's still here somewhere. Crocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Oh no! Where is it? Kinneret, save us. Here he comes again. He's coming. Coming in hot. Kill the dragon. Get down here. Don't be a wuss. Oh, Lord. They hurt. Ow. It's fine. It's fine. Just a little painful. Yes, Dragon Slayer. Dragon Slayer Crimson. Oh no! The guard! He died. That's sad. Use the shout section of the magic menu to equip your own relenting or shout. Magic. Shouts. Leave it. You're dragonborn. I'm what? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. I got something. I don't know what happened to me. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather used to tell stories. <laughs> That's a shout. Who's? That's on the mountain. I go Tiber Septim himself. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Yerleth? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, I must be one. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? What a wild thing, though, like... Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than... An orc? Gums on matters we don't know in orc, about. of all people? You know what I mean? Here's a dead dragon. Change up our light a little bit. I, I feel like it's a little... Understand. Now we know... A little funny. Some Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a Nord. I can all across town. You ain't a Nord. There's plenty of things just as outlandish as this. 
Neither am I. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting what you just did. Must be. You really are dragonborn then. Me? You don't say. Okay. That was the hairiest fight I've ever been in, and I've been in more than a few. I don't know about this dragonborn business, but I'm sure glad you're with us. You better get back to White Blood right away. Damn right. We want to know what happened here. Back to White Run. Why can't we go to Dra uh, Dragon Man's Keep? That's weird. Look, you already have been told you're not allowed here. Oh. Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to. I don't care. Ovakin. We will be back. This is not over. It's not over. You there. We're looking for someone in White Run. We will pay good money for information. You know, the last time a woman, we played, a foreigner in these lands, Redguard, like us. We didn't turn her over. Maybe we will, just to get that that part of the story. We will pay for any information regarding her location. Yeah. We are not welcome here in White Run. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. Why are you looking for this person? It's none of your concern. All you need to know is that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. Okay. We will find her eventually. Maybe. Maybe you will. Maybe you won't. I don't know. To the keep! Actually. Yeah, to the keep! Run! We are the children of man! By Izmir, you did it! Kill the dragon! Gods of man! Ascended from Christ! Nice. Blessing of Talos. I just did that mainly because <laughs> probably had a disease. Find all them wolves. Probably gave me lockjaw. That's not good. You don't want lockjaw. Gotta read a book then. Good. You're finally here. The all's been waiting for you. I am. You Hello. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. And I am Dragonborn. My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? The Watchtower is destroyed, but we killed the dragon. I knew I could count on Irileth, but there must be more to it than that. I don't know. I did a lot of the work, I feel like. Zapping him with my magic. Stabbed him in the head. That was a lot of me. A lot of me. When the dragon died, I absorbed some kind of power. So it's true. The gray beards really were summoning you. They were. Speak to the gray beards. Masters of the way of the voice. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. What do these gray beards want well me? The dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thoom or shout. If you really are dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tybeseptim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rungar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Rungar, don't be so hard on Avanichi. I meant no disrespect, of course. Yes, you did. It's just that... 
What do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeards' business, not ours. I've never seen someone so disrespectful in my life. Killed that dragon. It revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. Maybe. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me All in right. the city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. Nice. I assign you Lydia as for a personal Thane. house carl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? Yeah, I'm no riffraff. I'm honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. All right. That axe, let's take a look at it. Now, not that we're going to use it, but we can disenchant it. Thanks for the axe, man. Guess what? Blam! Ooh, and we have these. Nice. Cool. Ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. No, but do you have anything for me in your it seems wares? This damnable conflict has oh. claimed everyone's passions of late. What you got for sale? Hmm. I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. So much stuff. So many books. So many books. Okay. Yeah, I don't think the spell tomes count as books, so that's fine. It's probably a good thing. Um. Uh, stone flesh is gonna be really nice. It's just a better version of oak flesh. And then. Where's that? Frostbite is what we have. Ice Spike. That's the really the good ranged one. So we'll probably pick this up. And then So Oh my gosh, we even Sorry about that. The other thing we thought about doing was Bound Sword. I want to get... I want to get the Flame Antronaut. She was sick to use. I also kind of just want the Conjure Familiar for now. We're going to grab that. Just because it'll cost less to use. Let's, let's grab the Stone Flesh too. That's going to be useful. Um, I think that's it. For now. You know, you've got the aptitude. You should join the Mages College in winter. We will go do that. That's probably where we're going to head. Probably going to ditch this main quest for now and head. 
But there's a tranquility in magic, don't you think? A prospective student, are you? Well, I think the quest I'm, I'm not much good at here. teaching. You should try your luck at the College of Winterhold. Boom. Perfect. Remember, your mind is the best weapon you have. Perfect. Can we enchant our weapon? I mean, we don't have a good weapon, but... Frost damage, shock damage. That's not bad to have. I think it'd be good to have shock damage on it. Yeah. Charges. Hmm. Let's go about halfway so we have a decent amount of charges and damage. Daddy Soul Gem. Nice. The way certain materials are more or Perfect. less receptive to the force of light, is it not? Fortify stamina, might as well. This is just XP, so. Boom. Then we can throw that ring on. Nice. And the amulet of Talos. Not that we really need it, but we have no amulet on. It works. those hmm. so that's coming off because we don't really use that frostbite ice spike conjure familiar is going on oak flesh is coming off and stone flesh is going on it costs way more but once we start getting points into alteration it won't be so bad so maybe we'll actually keep Oak Flesh for now. And then we're good. Um, so one's my steel sword. Two, three, four, five, and then six will be my potion. Perfect. Perfect. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. I'm a Thane. What does that mean? The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the Hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honor. A gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. So you're saying I can just do whatever I want? As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Okay, well. Farewell. I don't like having followers. Personal, personal opinion. I do not like them. They're annoying. They get in the way. So, we just never use them. We'll collect them. We'll get them. But we're never going to use them. Um. So all the way up here is Winterhold. I think we can take a carriage to get over there. There has been talk amongst the gods that you are dragon. I am dragonborn. Supposedly. That's what all the uh, all the kids are telling me. Look, I don't really need the Talos shrine. We're gonna go in here quick. Out here. Uh, this one. RK. All the dead. And we're gonna get the... Shrine of RK. This gives us a little bit more health. Um... Blessing of RK. 25 health. Pretty good. Pretty good. I think this guy has a quest, too. Oh, he's sleeping. There's a new book. Yo, this guy's got so many books too. Nice. Two. Three. Four. Five. 
Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Okay, twelve more books. We stole those, but that's fine. I need anything for the books. Anything for the books. So twelve. It's thirty-nine. Fifty-one. No. Day one, we're at 50 books already? You telling me we're moving and grooving? In this chest. Okay. Alright, we won't steal your four gold. Tell me, do you believe I'm in not that horrible arcade, of a prison. God of life and death? Yeah, um, the God of death? I know him very well. I'm glad to know that because I need your help. You see, I've lost something precious. What, what, what did you lose? My amulet of RK. It's the source of my divine powers and also a sacred badge of office. I misplaced it in the catacomb. Why did you do that? I'd look for it, but I have been hearing noises down there. I fear the dead have become restless. Without that amulet, I'm powerless to confront them. Would you be willing to search for it? What a... What a loser. I'll just wait here and make sure nothing foul escapes the catacombs. I'll do your job for you, man. Aren't you supposed to be watching over this place? Isn't that your job? Man's a rookie. Into the catacombs. <laughs> There are skeletons down here. Good to know. Frickin' jerk. Oh, you know what I just saw? That's kinda neat. That the, uh, the mod does that. It shows what mobs are worth in gems. Whoa. Dang. Okay, so that's a new book. 52 now. Fifty-two. Why do I take all these goblets? I don't know. I don't think we're that petty. Yeah. I was not intimidated by your shield bashing. You have to do better. I am a wizard. Unusual gem. Oh, we found it. Look at that. That was it? That was a tough, tough quest. Real tough quest. Can't believe that guy couldn't go down there himself. And he went back to bed? He wasn't even doing what he said. He said he was going to watch the door to make sure nothing came out. I spend so much time. Oh, thank Arcane. What a freaking liar. Please, take this gold for your troubles. Oh, thank you so much. Walk always in the light in these days of darkness. What a waste of my time. Waste of my time. I think we can go sell that junk that we just got, and then maybe we'll just head up to, um, what should we call it? Quick. Because I think that's what we're going to do first. The college. I think that'll be good. 
to get some uh, some schooling done. Need supplies? See Bellathor at his store. I would, but he's not open. We gotta wait. Time's a ticking. Time's a ticking. Sleazy little man. But he has good stock. Still not open? Bellador. Come on, my guy. Hands off. Take a good look around. I'm sure you'll find what you're looking for. I've heard you're a sleazy not, man. Might have it stored away. Everything's for sale, my friend. Trinkets, odds and ends, that I, sort of I thing. I heard you're a sleazy man. Sell this stuff. Let's see. Weapons. Now we have that. Iron shields we don't need. Steel armor we don't need. You want some food? And then... Get rid of my garnets. That's good. Sweet. Take a look. What does he have actually? Because he might have some books. He does have books. We could. I am not gonna buy these. That seems like a waste of money. We can find them. You know what I mean? You could learn bound sword though. They could learn bound sword. I feel like that could be good if we go down Conjuration. I feel like that could be good. Do Let's see. Back. And then we just go into here. Where's Conjuration? Nope. Nope. There we go. Favorite. We un. We unfavorite this. You come back. Nice. This could be really cool. Did not mean to do that. Good thing we didn't blast somebody. Okay. Our plan. Head north. Seems like a good place to go. The winter hole. To learn how to be a wizard. Sir, I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Oh. Where do you want to go? Very nice of you. I would like to go to Winter Hold. We'll aye, aye. Why is it always raining? Is we're in Skyrim. Wouldn't it be snow? Well, I guess it depends on where you're at. It's probably pretty rainy there. I mean, if it snows a lot. Look at that. It's snowing right now. But now we're way up here. Way up north. at your own peril the way is dangerous and the gate will not open you shall not gain entry what do you mean what is this place Why are you out here i am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college and if in the process my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm so be it the more important question is why are you here 
I'm, I want to be a wizard. Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? I want to use the power of ice and fire to destroy any who oppose me. Uh, I want to unravel the mysteries of Aetherius. Ah, the immortal plane. It is said to be the source of all magic. This is a noble goal. Indeed. It is, yes. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. Fancy, fancy. Look a at me. A small test, if you will. Uh, I think you both. I think we both know. I'll succeed here. No, I'm afraid I don't know anything of the sort. Well, we tried. Excellent. The fear spell has saved the life of many an illusion mage. If you could cast it on the seal here on the ground, that would prove your skill. What? I don't know that spell. No? Well, if you think you're capable of it, then I'd be happy to provide it to you for a mere 30 gold. This or is a... you can try your luck with one of the court wizards around Skyrim. This is a they rip -off. also sell spells. Here you are. Now I'm anxious to see you cast it. What a rip-off. She's doing that, so I have to pay her. That's all that was. Where's this at? I not have it yet. Hello? Hello? Did she did she not give me the book? Excuse me. The college is an asset to Skyrim, even if it goes on. Magic? Did she just? Did I just learn it? Oh, I did. Ju I just learned it. That's weird. Noticed or unappreciated. Well done, indeed. I think you'll be a superb. I thought you gave me the book. The college. Welcome, apprentice. Boom. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Irvine, our master wizard. Please follow me. I'm sorry. Nice. Look at this. This is the cool thing. What? Did she say? I can't use magic? No matter what, the college will endure. Yeah, okay. Inside. This place is cool though. It's like way out. Way out in the water. On a giant cliff. Pretty cool. Need oh. something. Hey, bud. A fellow orc. I believe I've made myself rather clear. I think the college is yes, due for a change in leadership. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing. If you're I hate them. I'm afraid you'll find Please the Thalmor has received no such treatment here. I hate the Thalmor. Guest of the college, here at the pleasure of the I hate them so much. I hope Just you like appreciate anywhere else, the opportunity. It's all about who you know. Yes, of course. You know the Archmage has my thanks. Very good. Then we're done here. I'm not trying to talk to you, Mira. I'm trying to talk to Mirabella. I hope I can count on you if I ever need a favor. Welcome to the college. I was told to come see you. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, I am new. first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a Ooh, brief tour. Look at some ropes. Your first class. Are nice. you ready to begin? Novice hood, novice destruction robe. Okay. I'd love to have a look around. Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a Yeah, let's let's put those on. The novice hood is the same, but this gives us the destruction, which is nice. Skyrim for thousands of years. 
The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanian is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the college, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Okay. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. What's wrong with the Nords? Like the bandits? Is that what you're talking about? Are they rude? This place is nuts. Oh, go away. Go away. Don't. I don't like you. Go, Mirabelle. Get away from us. I'll do it. Our newest members are housed here. I'll I'll do it. Just that you please keep your voice down while inside. Oh. As others may be working on research or delicate experiments. I'm sorry. I got I got angry. I was yelling. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. Oh. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. This is pretty Please nice. Try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the hall. It's not as nice as where most of the members gather for lectures. Not as nice as Itzy. But I think the boots though, that'll be good to have. Take all this stuff. It's free. It's free. It's mine. I was gifted it. A book. Okay. We're up to 53 books. Where did she say we have to go now? Um. Oh, we're just following her still. Okay. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Tolfdir. I bet I can get a bunch of books up here. You know what I mean? It's a college. Nice. That's pretty sick. Oh, and it gives me a timer in the corner. I like that. I like that. Some of the mod stuff is nice. Really handy. Really freaking handy. Okay. So, before we go into Tolftier, this seems like a pretty good spot to stop for the night. We got a lot done. We got a lot done. Um, we got, uh, what, 52 books? 53 books? Um, out of the 337, that's pretty nuts. But, there's a lot to go. And obviously we're just going to like explore and, and play the game itself. But thank you so much for hanging out. Hope you had a good night. It was my first, first night session. Um, like I said, I start vacation tomorrow. So I will be back uh, Monday morning at 8 a.m. Central Daylight Time. And I believe we're going to continue Skyrim. If I'm not mistaken. Um, that's the plan. So... I will see you, everyone, on Monday. Thank you so much. We'll be back to the morning, and I will see you next time. Have a good night.